If you are new to the channel guys, then this is what it's all about. I go on many adventures, oh yeah. Solo wild camps, collaboration camps, I enjoy woodland camps with awesome food. You just can't beat a good campfire. I review awesome camping gear. I go on van life adventures and I'm sure you'll see me hit the road really soon. So it's time to hit the mountains again for more future wild camps. Oh yeah! Five towers, I believe. There's a main entrance down this end. We had one, two. Castle grounds, 13th century. It looks like a cool place for a wild camp. It's a long time.
Seriously, right? Hey guys, if this is actually recording right now, right? Trust me, don't buy a GoPro. Yeah? They say they fix a 10 mine, so you might well look at that one. Just don't get a 9. And subscribe to Boys in the Wood. Yeah, and subscribe to Boys in the Wood. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, uh, guys, bit of advice, try not leave your cameras on the floor, on the road. Yeah. Otherwise, they get knocked down by a car. And, and, and I have to run from. Shout out to Granite Gear, awesome company. Uh, my chest strap, uh, the clip broke. This little clip here that I snapped and yeah I sent them a quick email. They sent me a new clip. Yeah, be careful. Cause we got some weight on our packs. You right? Yeah, it's quite a tough it's always fun 
when you're out with Gaz. I'll tell you what, that was steep. Safest way of doing that then is keeping yourself forward. You wouldn't be able to stand up, otherwise your pack would just pull you back and as it, you're gone. guys try and find somewhere flat so we can put the tents up right then guys the sun's just gone down beyond that mountain by there and it's time to get a tent up so it's a lot of uh, you know, you usually expect a lot of sheep shit about the place and stuff like that, but uh, I think I'll put a tent for you. First time putting a scarf one up, it's hope it's nice and easy. guys I got a tent up and what a nightmare yeah there's one thing that uh, confused me a little bit and that's the pole that goes through the sleeve in the center the end I couldn't find like the ring that the end went into but then it's like some little sleeve but I had to watch a video and it started pissing on my rain. So in the meantime, trying to work out how to connect this pole, we got soaked. So yeah, not happy with that. So some of our uh, gears wet. It's a bit late for me to put my rain jacket on now, isn't it? <laughs> Hi. I'm dry now anyway, eh? Yeah. As I said guys, it started raining, put a tent up. Gez over there, don't know if we can make out his tent in the distance by there, but he got his up because it was both new tents for us. You know, it was a bit of a faff. I should have learned how to put this up before I left the house, but yeah, it's up now and it's awesome. Happy days, he said. We also had a nice visit from Lee Callahan. It's nice to meet you, Lee. Lee Callahan, fair play to him, brought us up some chips. What a guy. Give a shout out to Lee Callahan 
I'll leave a link below. Check the channel out, give him a sub. Awesome guy. Also, I got a bottle of Ardies to drink. So, a nice Shiraz. Love a good Shiraz. <laughs> uh, talking to Gav. Gav, we miss you. Wish you could have come here, but... Well... <laughs> Why do I say he's working again? Uh, we go in, Gaz. Huh? You're going for a piss, you. <laughs> You're filming, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> you already photographed me having a piss earlier, so I'm going to wait until you finish filming now, mate, because I know you're dirty. Uh, I'm about to go to bed, so God knows what he wants to do with that footage. How you doing, guys? That's Gaz's tent. Awful job of putting it up, but it was cold, wet, and windy. And that was my first yeah. time. Well, I'll be showing you the tents tomorrow, guys. It's my tent over there, see a little speck. So we'll have a look at Gezers tomorrow because this is brand new. It's not a forecast rain tonight. Oh, we went earlier though. So <laughs> the stars are out. And we're off in. Yeah, we're off the bed now guys. It's absolutely freezing. Yeah. It's got to be probably about one degree in there, but that, yeah, that wind one. chill. It's not zero. No, we've been out in it for nine hours now this wind, haven't we? Yeah, like, so yeah, we tired, cold. Yeah, so I figured I'd just tuck myself in and watch a bit of YouTube. It's half past eight. <laughs> it's only half past eight. That's a record for me, Alice. 8.33 to be exact. <laughs> anyway, sign off, guys. And we'll see you in the morning. No condensation at all whatsoever in the Scarp 1 tent. Yep, pretty amazing. Well happy with that. Just woke up guys and that was a rough sleep. <sighs> woke up 3 in the morning, took me a while to get back and then just tossed and turned all night. But there you go, so I think we're going to pack up now and drop down because it's gone a little bit windy again. It was calm through the night but the wind has picked back up so yeah, Gare's got all uh, breakfast, sausage, bacon, you name it, he got it all so fair play to him. And, uh, see what I mean? Wind yep yeah. Sun has just come up. Looks like it's gonna be a beautiful day. I'm meeting up with Mark, Geraint, and Daran. Oh yeah. Guys, laying on the map with no 
the way inside. <laughs> Cold ass night. <laughs> well, all night. Uh, I think it happened about twelve o'clock. So twelve. Yeah. Uh, that's when I first noticed it was down. And, well, you uh, managed to sleep more, though. Know? Well, I got out of the tent and leaned back in to try and blow it up, and it went up. And I thought, oh, it didn't seem to be going back down, so maybe the valve just wasn't stuck in properly. But then that uh, came again at four o'clock, it was down again, so I just had to grin and bear it, so to say. It happens. Uh, that don't sound any fun to me. Can't think of anything worse. Laying on a, a mat, just flat. Yeah, I'll leave after a while before I set it down because I'm back out in again tonight and it's the last thing I want to be doing packing away wet tent so starting to dry now anyway beautiful tent though guys a scarp one and we had a fair amount of wind last night and it was a dream absolutely beautiful I am well happy with a scarp one. Uh, tonight I'm going to try and uh, strap these around, stop them from flapping. And this is our little bungee they sent us. I gotta say, you've worked quite hard on that. <laughs> Keeps me warm. Yeah. I'm rebuilding the castle, though. Rebuilding the castle. Oh, that looks good, guys. Oh, yeah, that looks awesome. Happy days. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Need that. Guys. If you know, you will know. <laughs> this is to you. Is it? From Darren. Oh, thank you, Darren. <laughs> thank you very much, buddy. <laughs> Finally earned one. Yeah, I well. Get him out on a camp. He thought it was your birthday, so <laughs> I did explain to him what happened, but yeah, so he's going to bring me one later on tonight, so. Oh. Cheers. Thank you, Darren. <laughs> <laughs> All packed up. Ready to leave. Leave no trace. It was as if I wasn't even here. Oh, yeah. Well, we was going to make breakfast up here, guys, but it's a little bit windy. Um, we just decided we're going to make our way back down to the car now and get ourselves a McDonald's and then I'm off to meet Mark from Hunting and Camping Wales. Oh yeah! And Darren and Geraint. Can't wait for the next one. Going up to Ellen Valley. So keep an eye out for the next video and I'll catch you soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe and don't forget to subscribe to this dude beer. Boys in the Woods. Best channel on YouTube. Best channel on YouTube. <laughs> I will, I actually will admit to that. <laughs> awesome channel. So don't forget to like and subscribe guys. I'll see you in the next one. Oh yeah. Yeah, that was an awesome camp that was guys. I enjoyed it mate. It's a Seeing the wind and average it's just cold. Look what I'm with. Mark from Hunting the Camp in Wales. Yep, on our next adventure now. I'll see you in the next one. Up to the Elan Valley, let's go. Oh yeah.